What is going on everybody? How are you guys doing today? What I have for you today in this video is I want to talk to you guys about the upcoming battery technology from Samsung. So we all know that Samsung has integrated the adaptive fast charging, which if you guys are not aware, uh, due to maybe you don't use Samsung products at all, or maybe you're on an older device, whatever the reasoning may be, adaptive fast charging gives Samsung's Galaxy products the ability to have the batteries charge a little bit quicker. So going from 0% to 100% a lot faster than your standard normal charging speeds. Now, how is this achieved? Well, Samsung has integrated some technology within the battery, not only that, but also inside the devices themselves. And they make their cables in a certain way that also utilizes the adaptive fast charging along with the charging adapters that you use to plug into your wall outlet and then plug in your USB cord. Now, you have to use that specific USB cord along with that specific power adapter in order to get the adaptive fast charging. Not only that, you also need to have the appropriate device that works along with that charger. So say, for instance, if you are using a charger that came with your Galaxy S8 and then you decided to all of a sudden plug in your Galaxy S4 into that exact same charger. Well, I should take that back. Let's do the S7 and then the S4 using the S7 charger because the S8 is using USB-C. By doing that, there were reports where the adaptive fast charging was so powerful for that S4 that it wound up catching on fire or something. So you want to make sure that whatever adaptive fast charging that came with your uh, Samsung phone, you want to make sure you use that original one. And of course, you want to using like aftermarket cables, aftermarket wall outlets that don't have the adaptive fast charging ability. Your phone's still going to charge. It's just going to take a long time. And my notifications are going crazy on my Note 8. But that's basically the adaptive fast charging. Now, there are rumors going around where Samsung may integrate some sort of technology into the batteries where it's going to charge your battery five times faster. So you'll basically go from 0% to 100% within 12 minutes. Now, that's pretty insane to see that a battery will be charging that fast. But the question is, is it safe at the same time? Because when you're dealing with technology that is involved in the battery, you really want to be careful. And we definitely seen that due to the incident with the Note 7 uh, catching on fire. You got to be careful with lithium ion batteries because if you're not utilizing the lithium ion batteries correctly, then something will go wrong and then it could be very harmful. So let's take into the fact that it'll take 12 minutes to charge a battery from 0% to 100%. You know, that's great because maybe because you have somewhere to go in an hour and your phone is completely dead, you have to plug it up to the charger. And the unfortunate part is you're not going to get the most battery life out of it because most likely it may not charge to 100% unless you have the adaptive fast charging feature where it'll be close to 100%, but it may take a little bit more than an hour. Now, in this case, going from 0% to 100% for literally 12 minutes is an awesome feature, but it could be concerning for the battery as well because when it's going to charge that fast, most likely I would assume that the battery is going to get warm as well as the phone. And because of that, you're wearing out the compartments of your phone as well, but you may also wear out the battery life. But then again, they may be able to integrate some sort of technology where it's not going to do that. So we just have to see how science plays into this. But first thing that came up uh, in my mind was like, what kind of concerns uh, that might raise on people's minds when they hear about this feature and if it's actually going to be real. So if this is going to be real, I'm hoping that Samsung really does their homework and basically make sure that it won't be as harmful and not harmful at all as what had happened with the Note 7. So far, I've used my Note 8 for a few months now and I'm loving it. And there's no concern about anything that came from the Note 7 onto Note 8. There weren't any signs that that made me want to be that concerned about my phone. So we're just hoping for the best that Samsung nails this because it would be neat to have very fast charging times just like that. At the same time, having that kind of charging time also comes with great responsibility and we got to make sure that it's safe at the same time and that no one's going to get hurt. What do you guys think about this? Do you guys think it's going to be real? Do you guys think it's just rumors going around that it's actually not going to happen this way? Do you feel like in terms of charging your lithium ion battery within the 
a smartphone, tablet, whatever device it may be. Is it a neat feature to have, but is it also safe or would you rather just have the traditional adaptive fast charging feature along with the longer charging times? Leave a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment. Also check out the description below for my social media links to our Instagram. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.